is the boiler for your apartment unit. Now granted the apartment units are, are small and they don't use um, a lot of, of um, hot water. So mostly that's really probably for your radiant floor. Is that electric boiler? Yes. Well, this is the demo model. Yes, it was. I mean, it was kind of all, let's, let's go from, you know, that make-believe that this thing was part of that whole demonstration site. Oh, this is what we're selling you. This is what we're telling you is green. And then now, let's make it luxurious. Then this is what you really get. Um, but some of the specifics, when you really got to the technology of it, um, looked like there was some whole thinking. A lot of this, and this is, this is, um, became part of the discussion while we were there visiting, is a lot of it's designed on a computer, and the reality, and I think this is what led me to Senate's book, the reality when you separate hand and head is you get very paper thin understanding of physical space. And so some of the details were truly paper thin. Oh, it might be green on paper, but it wasn't green in reality, even in a model where it would have been very easy to make it green. They had a, a green wall, you know, living plants that were all plastic. <laughs> um, but the fridge, so now this is, this is how to grow food in your house. So everybody in, these, in this new green lifestyle will have their own, um, you know, not just, it's a, it's a pantry basically, growing your own spinach and grass and sprouts and so forth. Um, your, you know, it's to, what am I calling it? Bio, uh, um, you know, hydroponics, hydroponics. And then, and, the, and I included this car, because here's the mini car that, and this was the Hyundai showroom called Hillsides. So they're trying, here's the car, but you saw back to the model, the model still had full-size full cars. So the two aren't quite in alignment. Um, oh yeah, so then why do we, you know, that was then the question that I landed on in terms of this Mazdar and Songdo and so forth. Why are we building what we build? And I don't have an answer. I mean, maybe it's an age-old question. But there's this quote about something nearly innocent in human beings can produce a risk, and they were referring to the risk of Pandora's box. Men and women are seduced by sheer wonder, excitement, curiosity, and so create the fiction that opening the casket is a neutral act. About the first weapon of mass destruction, Eric could have cited a diary note made by Robert Oppenheimer, director of the Los Alamos Project. Oppenheimer reassured himself by asserting, when you see something that is technically sweet, you go ahead and do it and argue about what you do and argue about what to do about it only after you have technically succeeded. That is the way it was with the atomic bomb. Um, so just this was a, an example from Turkey of what I see as hand and craft and head coming together um, where, yes, there's a lot of skill to it, but there's also a lot of beauty that kind of jumps out of the pattern of something. Um, and then, you know, what are we doing with technology and is it, and he does play around with, you know, what's leading us spiritually. Um, and, and so and then just to land on another image of once we separate art out, you know, where does technology land? <laughs>